all right guys in this video we are going to send a mail okay and we are using a mail trap uh, which is you know fake mail fake mail uh, like you can you know uh, like email you can send mail okay uh, it's mail trap uh, you can go to mailtrap.io and now uh, we have to log in or sign up I will sign up and I will use uh, let's say email uh, let's say code online at the red gmail dot com uh, and after password let's say code online no I will change that because you can use that all right I will say something else I won't say you I'm not a robot let's sign up and yeah let's save that mm, okay now let's log in yeah remember me and log in you have to confirm that email oh my god I don't have that email so I have to use real one Uh, so I have to create again new one all right that's okay we'll just really use github account all right <coughs> sorry guys uh, okay we'll see email uh, our you know uh, email here okay our fake mail so let's go to our laravel and <clears throat> and and we want to show that email when our product is created whenever we create a product uh, say here uh, uh, after we submit and our product is created we want to show that email okay so let's let's do that uh, let's go to our controller product controller all right and after the product this is the line which so which create our product so after the product is created we want to say uh, mail Actually, let's let's have our app key and app secret. New project. We'll say Laravel series. Laravel series. Add this project. You have reached the project limit. Please upgrade your plan. What? I haven't made any. Oh, so demo inbox is our project. Let's go here. Yeah. Now let's actually copy these things. Uh, what are required? Uh, let's go to our env that env where is that uh, let's close all of these mm -hmm. where is that here it is uh, laravel gives our you know mail trap here it is uh, smtp smtp.mailtrap.io mail port 2525 username let's copy username all right let's copy this let's paste that here i will delete that you know user account so you cannot use that and yeah encryption no mail from address no okay maybe that will work okay let's stop the server and let's do php artisan serve after our env change all right and let's let's now let's send the mail we'll say mail send uh let's uh we'll make a uh you know view file to to uh say what we want to send okay we'll send we'll make a emails folder in which we'll say a file product created blade for the created blade and we want to send our let's let's have one variable to you know to store whatever our product is created and we'll send that to array so we'll say product to array it will convert our product to array and after that after that we will have a function dollar message all right and that's a function so okay and after that we'll say dollar message it says it's a message message to whom uh, I'll say message to code online 
What is our email address? Where is that? Yo. I don't know, but I know. Uh, code online. My name at the rate gmail.com please don't send any random image okay email uh, let's say code online we'll see what that does okay and we'll say subject uh, we want to say product is so it's just subject uh, that it will show whatever that is done okay subject of mail you know uh, and yeah 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 that's it now let's create our what happened Ooh, dollar message to this guy and i don't know what happened what happened what happened oh my god oh my god okay message to whom dollar message to Oh, code online like this. It should be all right. Now, what happened again? Let's change the line. Mm -mm -mm. Do we need semicolon here? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Now, let's um, let's make our you know, view inside view. We'll make a folder, uh, and name it emails. And inside that, we can have you know like product created, product updated, product deleted, whatever. You can use this and after deleting, you can use that. After updating, you, you can use that, okay? Whatever you can do, change email, okay? So let's say, um, what is here, product created? So let's say product created, C-R-E-A-T-E-D created dot blade dot PHP. And inside that we'll say, um what we'll say is uh hello product was created all right and we'll say um let's 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 in uh we have dollar product access okay so we'll say just because we have seen that to array so we'll say product uh, name let's let's do that all right Let's create a product. Okay, um, let's say, let's say for mail. Let's say watch again, watch one. Price, I don't have any, I don't have option. All right, watch. And let's submit that and let's see if we get email, no, oh so i didn't use that okay so i have to use this class all right so where where is that where is that where is that our controller we have to use that at top at top so we'll say use uh i don't know if it's okay i think it's okay let's refresh that continue and uh, yeah again let's refresh we will say watch one rise and file watch all right let's submit what is this laravel mail let's see let, mail facade yeah so what is that godzilla no godzilla you know Mail. Here it is in Illuminate support facades mail. So let's use that. Let's refresh. Okay, guy, you have to re re redirect. Okay, so cannot send message without a sender address. Sender address. Oh. So let's go to our environment i think mail from i think we need that let's say code 
code online.com so it'll it'll give our that okay let's do okay guy you have to do that come on let's let's restart this server to when you will say that uh, uh, uh code code online doesn't comply with rfc oh, oh, oh that is domain name let's do gmail.com at the way gmail.com save that let's restart again and let's refresh let's continue you have to do now otherwise otherwise i'll code i'll change the code okay oh my god thousand time because that was mail problem because we we are just sending mail after the product is created but our code was wrong okay uh where here uh it used to you know where is that it used to create the product but mail wasn't sending that that was a problem let's check if there is an email for us uh yeah here it is you can see that only one mail because uh yeah oh what is that so let's 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 do that actually we have we you you have you have to, i mean we have to use two curly braces save that let's let's add one okay because we have added a tons you know let's let's do that here we'll say tv tv one 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 all right price whatever we like and file oh baby come on submit what is that undependent variable product name product price to make variable option product created uh undefined variable so this variable is not is not you know defined let's see here here we have said dollar product to array i don't know what is that let's try you know there is nothing wrong so it'll create two product again i don't know if this this time it'll work or not oh come on yeah it has worked let's see if our if if it's give if it gives us that name oh my god no 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 so let's see uh how we can send mail uh, let's see in our my you know github uh it's gonna be a little long, but you shouldn't worry. I'm gonna take you, okay? Resources, views, emails, were created, and oh, that was an array. So uh, let's do, what's that, that, I don't know. Again, I think I'm making a mistake. Yeah, right. All right, let's create one. This will be final, I'm sure. TV for price and file. Submit. Constant name, assume name, this will show in future ver future version. What is that? Oh my god. Product name, 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 dollar name. What is that? Why, why it is giving an error oh dollar name that that was so limited so this is the last time all right why is this yo so oh product has title not name my mistake okay all right this is the final time <laughs> this is uh, this is uh, my promise okay this is final time you don't have to do that again all right, TV for for all right. You can also have price and many things. This is for a long video, so I'm just gonna quit. Okay, in next video we'll we'll see what we can do.